I'm Scott Thompson and here are your top stories from Two Works For You. Tulsa police say a missing 14 year old boy has just been found. Emmanuel Carney was found at a friend's house unharmed. Police said he has severe medical issues and he ran away from his own home near 31st and Memorial last night, but he's safe now. East Pine Street in North Tulsa remains shut down between Yale and Sheridan after a water main break got even bigger overnight. It started as a leak a couple of days ago and about 100 homes have been without water ever since. The city says it could take another four to six hours to fix that problem. An apparent plan for a mass shooting at Pawnee High School is foiled just a couple of weeks before classes are set to begin there. Police department intercepted a plan that two teenagers were reportedly working on. Those teenagers are in jail and the FBI is working on this case as well. Let's get a check of today's forecast from meteorologist John Haverfield. Yeah, thank you, Scott. For this afternoon, highs in the mid-90s, so a hot and humid day today. We'll see an ozone alert for the Tulsa Metro as well. So again, you want to avoid creating any kind of additional pollution to help alleviate some of those ozone issues through today. A 20% chance for an isolated shower or storm by the afternoon. Most areas will stay dry, but some of those pop-up pop -up showers uh, could be in the forecast later on today. So we'll have to watch out for that. 94 the high today in Bartlesville, 95 today here in Tulsa, 94 prior with mostly sunny skies. Very, very light winds today out of the south, only at about five miles per hour. 93 for Saturday, a 30% chance for some showers and storms by the afternoon. As we head towards Sunday, a better chance for rain as our highs dip down to the mid 80s. We stay in the mid to lower 80s on Monday. Right now, Monday just looks kind of like a washout with some really heavy rain in our area possibly leading to rainfall totals up to four to five inches through next week as we continue to see some daily rounds of some afternoon showers and storms with highs remaining in the mid to upper 80s for Tuesday and Wednesday. Have a great day.